I just wanted to show y'all an example of a real woman after giving birth, what the stomach looks like. You'll have this swelling. You will have this swelling until three to four weeks after giving birth. Your uterus has to contract back in, until it's regular size. It has to shrink. Your uterus has to shrink. Okay? You don't see that with unsexy red. Okay? Y'all love to bring up, oh, unsexy red had a son. We can go look at the old fabricated pictures. Those are not old pictures. Okay? Well, considering that, okay, her son is supposedly three years old. So, okay, those are pictures from 2020, I guess. I guess. But then they try to make it look like, oh, look, those photos were shot on an old T-Mobile sidekick. So I feel like a lot of those photos of before the fame, Sexy Red might be fabricated too. Who knows? I don't trust that character. I don't trust them. They are a Decepticon. They are dis a deceiver. And they are here to destroy the black community, to put the final nail in the coffin. And they're here. They planted this character to influence your children. That's why they strategically put this character in the algorithm on TikTok, put them in every kid's for you and LBGTQ person for you page. They know if they can get the the rainbow guys and the children to like their music, they pretty much won over pop culture. If you can get the LBGTQ to love you pretty much, they run shit now, not black people. It's the rainbow people. And then, you know, they use them to influence your children on that app. I mean, that was what, you know, the former president was warning about this app. But, hey, y'all let these people push their agendas for the whole four years. And now they want to take the app away because working class people are able to make money off the, that app and like create their own business, small online businesses. And they don't have to work for these corporations. That's why they want to get rid of the app now. They push their agendas to the fullest. And now they have no use for this app anymore. People making too much money. They want to get rid of it. But this is what a real woman looks like after giving birth. This is what my stomach looked like after giving birth. Every time. Both times. So y'all just love letting these industry plants run game on you. Okay? Like, they want women to go out here and do everything that Sexy Red did during their so-called pregnancy. Just be twerking around, drinking, smoking, doing ratchet shit. Twerk your way into the hospital. Twerk on the hospital beds. Before and after getting giving birth while amniotic fluid is leaking down your leg. That's what they want black women to be doing. And then Sexy Red is showing that, oh, black women don't need maternity leave. They don't need uh, anything to aid with pain during their uh, labor and delivery. No, we're not human. We are. She pretty much is showing society, okay, maybe they're right. Maybe the white supremacists are right. Maybe black people are subhuman. They don't need pain you know, management or anything like that during childbirth, because that's the theories they were coming up with during so-called slavery when they were experimenting on our ancestors. But OK, y'all want to give this bitch a complete pass like these celebrities don't be lying about what like these celebrities won't lie about getting work done. Y'all sit here and believe like, oh, these celebrities will just be honest and truthful. Why? Why would someone who called themselves so-called the sexy devil literally give hint that they worship Satan. They worship the devil, okay? And I know y'all want to sit here, oh, the devil's not real, and you know, all that in this, you know, the woke spiritual pro-black stuff, okay? But at the end of the day, the elites worship this thing, this entity, this deity, whether you believe it's Satan or Saturn or whatever, they worship it. They have a whole church for it. The dark one, okay? This dark entity exists, okay? They just got y'all duped to believing that, oh, evil isn't real. Evil only lies within religion. But no, good and evil existed before the creation of religion. These forces exist. Okay? Whether y'all want to believe it or not. And Sexy Red is evil as fuck. For them to make that shit-ass music, talking about their booty hole and their private parts and then to go to your children's school elementary schools middle schools high schools to do meet and greets knowing what their music is about that motherfucker's evil and i'm tired of y'all trying to play me like oh i'm a hater for exposing evil it's my purpose to expose evil to expose deception that is my purpose and i'm not gonna let anybody silence me or stop me from doing what i'm sent here to do 
Y'all, when I first got up out that bed and I seen that my stomach looked like I was still like five and a half months pregnant, I said, hold on, wait a minute. What is going on here? Like, my other two kids, I snapped back or my stomach with King was not as flat, but it wasn't as big, baby. What's going on? Tell me what's going on. But you know what? Every pregnancy is different. This is the third child and I am older. So, I had to put this waistband on, which I was going to already do anyways, but baby. And I told my mama, I was like, yeah, when I put the waistband on, it still was poking out. Normally, when I put the waistband on, baby, my stomach be sucked in. She's like, well, what? Well, yeah, this is, might be a more extreme case of the stomach swelling because, yes, yeah, she said this is her third child. But, yes, at the end of the day, we do still have, like, this stomach swelling issue where your stomach will either look between three to five months pregnant and you put the little stomach binder on and it flattened. It kind of flattened things. Okay. But, yeah, you're going to have, like, you, it's just, it's, you're going to have this swelling because your uterus is five times larger than what it normally is okay and everything's pushed up your stomach and everything is still pushed up okay so yeah it's important to wear these binders and waist trainers and stuff like that to push everything back into place in my world see how i feel and all i could do is laugh because that's funny but at the same time ooh, uh, uh, i don't like the feeling so my original plan was to be on my products but you guys i detoured i did the the breastfeeding route so now i just have to go into eating small portions working out you know the original y'all don't want to hear me y'all don't want to listen to me but they are making these celebrities raise these designer babies or clone babies genetic clone babies right now it, they're t they're doing that with the celebrities first Soon, whole society is going to be forced to just buy babies instead of actually producing babies naturally. They don't want women to, put, to push out babies, to produce babies naturally. They want only for us to come to them, you know, the government. They're going to want us to come to them to get permission to have a baby and to pay them. You're going to have to have money to have babies, just like in the movie 1984. Please go look... At, please go watch the movie 1984 so y'all can get my reference. This is the type this is the type of government they want in the future. This is the tyrannical This is the type of government they're going to want in the future and it's going to be doom and gloom. Grayscale futuristic type of environment. It's not even going to be a happy environment we won't have advanced technology they, they don't want us to have advanced technology they don't want us to have free energy technology that benefit the world no they don't want that that's why they keep us dumbed down please wake up please wake up weight loss part of this lifestyle but anyways y'all i'm gonna be wearing this consistently so if you see me with this waistband don't mind your business and just know that i'm gonna be consistent with wearing it and can you ask me today why I still look like I got a baby in my stomach. Um, sir, I'm trying to figure out the same thing. But you know what? It's okay, though. It's okay. Y'all, when I...